Good morning. Welcome back. <laughs> um, I have a little bit to update y'all on. Um, I'm going to take you through my day. I don't exactly know how it's going to go. I need to clean up because our kitchen's like a mess and we were in a rush this morning before Tanner had to leave. And I need to take a shower, get ready, pack a little bit more, organize some more areas to pack because we like to organize it first so we know what's going where. And then I might head out to a coffee shop depending how long Tanner's day is gonna be so I can get some work in because I literally sold my entire office set so I don't have anything to sit on anymore <laughs> but um, I'm gonna take you along with the day and just kind of see what we're doing but it's been a while since I've done like a vlog and I haven't updated so we're moving again and this is a bigger move <laughs> it's a little overwhelming um, and we're moving to a whole new area. Last time we moved, it was just like 20 minutes into a different section of like the area we were in, but we're moving far. So we're gonna do a full like updated, like why we move, where-ish, and like the whole background on the idea of moving um, once we are there. And we can show you like our whole tour, but overall, like we bought a house. We've been renting and we bought a house. I haven't processed it fully yet. I'm, so, I'm understanding the things like that are going on now, <laughs> but it happened so quickly that I literally have yet to fully process the uh, concept of us moving possibly later this year when our like rent lease thing was up to having less than 30 days to pack up and move. It's just a lot going on. so. I just want to update there like we are and like moving so I'm gonna kind of show you today go through my day but I'm gonna go have a shower quick um, and then I'm just gonna do like a little montage because I got to clean up and put the kitchen stuff away and then we'll do some packing together and see kind of where the day takes us but it's vlog time so I'm gonna go shower and I will be back looking a little more better <laughs> okay I am back from the shower I just put some oil in my hair and put a little bit of makeup on so I felt more ready for the day. Um, but I'm still finishing the breakfast that I made like an hour and a half ago. Um, I made this smoothie and then I have a bagel with peanut butter and jelly. I'm eating a lot of food right now um, just to grow in general because I was getting really lean but like just I felt like I was losing so much muscle and I hated it and I'd rather be a little like thicker and feel strong and full. So I increased my food and this whole breakfast, like the smoothie and the bagel, is like 1,200 calories. Before, that was literally almost my entire day eating. <laughs> like it's crazy. So um, I'm going to be eating a lot in this video probably, but I'm going to go and clean the kitchen. So I got to figure out where I can set the camera up because my blonde head just realized I packed all my tripods that are tall and I have just my little one that you guys are sitting on right now. So let me figure that out and I'll come back and we're gonna do a cleaning montage of the kitchen so that's done and I can relax from that and then we're gonna pack. <laughs> if you see my food baby from the side, let's just ignore that. I, like I said, eating a lot of food and it's not the most flattering, but let's clean. And <laughs> I'm gonna jam to some music. <laughs> Sorry, this is super bright. I just finished cleaning the kitchen. I don't think that's gonna fix anything. Um, so I'm gonna do a little bit of work because I need to finish my post for today, and then I'm gonna do packing. So I'm gonna just take a little bit of a break from vlogging <laughs> um, and just go sit and write my post out. It's not gonna take me long, and then we'll get to packing and show you guys kind of like what it looks like right now, especially if you haven't been here since the beginning we moved in and I did my apartment tour. So let's get my work done so we can do more fun stuff. <laughs> Making my posts took me so much longer than I expected because like I have zero motivation to make Instagram posts, TikToks, anything because I went from having an account that had millions to like thousands and thousands of likes on everything I'd post, like views and likes, to maybe getting like a hundred if I'm lucky. So I don't know what happened to my accounts or like why they all disappeared off people's feeds and stuff, but I hate posting now. So I just sat there and I was like, why do I even bother? 
I finally made a post. I don't, I'm not, I don't care. <laughs> but it is 12.03. So I'm standing in the office right now, or what used to be the office. Obviously, like I said, I sold all my office furniture. But I'm just going to go through here and then kind of see what I can pack up. Obviously, like the whole wall behind the camera is like all Tanner stuff. And I'm leaving that to him so that he can pack it however he wants and make sure he has stuff out for the next few weeks. But I pretty much just work out of literally like I have a purse, like a big purse. And that's like what I'm working out of. And so that's my life right now and my job. So I'm going to clean up the rest of my stuff so it's all done. Um, I think... I think I'm just gonna go make one box just to put some like miscellaneous pieces in it so that way like all my little things are off the floor and then like I said he'll do his stuff another time but let's get a box made so we can start. I just remembered I had one box made from the last stash of boxes that we had so I'm just gonna use that but I don't know like how well you guys are gonna see anything in here. Um. Basically, I'm just going to put my random stuff, like this is literally the last thing that's in the closet, which is just, what are they called? It's a blow up mattress and then my, I have a, a backdrop, like setup thing, so that's the backdrop paper. This needs to stay out. Okay, so purse, little thing. I think... I think I'm gonna have to put these in a box. I don't think I can take them like this. I just use the box to put boxes in. That's ridiculous. Um, I have more there, but those ones aren't hooked together with something. So I also need them out in case I sell anything in the meantime. But I think that's it. I need a big box, like a, ow, my foot, I stepped on a cord. I need some large boxes for the fact that that just move um we have taller objects in there like the paper wrapping paper stuff for presents so that's that but for the most part everything's done i'm just going to shove like just flatten that box in there and then i'm going to add the rest of this paper pack and i think that's all i can really pack in here right now I'm gonna leave this box open though for Tanner because there is a little bit of room in there. Um, but other than that, all my stuff is pretty much packed. So, or at least in here. So let's go do the laundry room. And I think that's gonna be the only part I do today because the rest of the stuff like we need. We need for the next few weeks. So we can't really pack it all, but we can do some of the laundry stuff because I haven't even touched it since we've lived here. one more box so we have out I just hit my finger weird um, one to put some stuff in in that closet but I literally think this is gonna be the last part because the rest of the stuff is more clothing and stuff we're using right now like the rest of the kitchen because we packed up everything we can so I think we're just gonna do this box this closet and then I'm gonna get dressed with a shirt <laughs> And grab myself and we're going to go to a coffee shop because Tanner said he's not going to be too, too long today, hopefully. Okay, so let me see if I can show you. Okay, so basically in our like laundry room, I know how well you guys can see it. We just keep like all of our random stuff. So there's like a bin of like hair stuff, hand lotions, like the Bath and Body Works stuff. We have like old sheets for like spare ones, random stuff. I literally have a beer, pong, beer bong in there that I've used once for pre-workout and never for actual alcohol. <laughs> Toilet paper, tools, my makeup, and just cleaning stuff. So I'm just gonna go through it, pick stuff that we don't need out right now. So that way it can get cleared a bit. But I don't think 
minus a bar of soap. We need anything from here. That's nothing. Okay. Let's see. I think I'm going to take everything out of these bins and then collapse the bin because it's not going to fit in these boxes. So these are just like all of our, like my old bedding that like barely got used or like extra pillowcases that came with our new stuff that we don't use. So I'm keeping it for the fact that we're going to make a spare room at our new place. Sorry, we're trying to figure out if a package is showing up. <laughs> um, so I'm keeping it for a new place. So we have something maybe to use for that bed or at least until we like get new stuff. Um, but yeah. Okay. Also keeping this really ratty towel for our dog that we get soon. Also guys, I feel like there's so many updates that I have yet to even give because I keep forgetting. I haven't filmed on YouTube, like posted for a couple weeks. So I haven't said anything, but yeah, we're moving. We bought a house, we're getting a dog. Our world took a full 360. I'm not sure what to do with this now. Let's put it there. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna do the same thing and empty this out. This is my beer bong for pre-workout. This is the most random bin of life, holy. I think the rest of the stuff we need to keep out because we have to clean the apartment before we leave, so I need all that. I'm gonna put the makeup in a different one because it doesn't fit in this one, and then we need toilet paper and tools to do any stuff, so. That's that. Oh, she's a little full. I feel like I'm gonna tape my hair because it keeps hanging down so long. It's so weird having this box because all the other boxes that I've used, because this is the first one from this pack I showed you, all the other ones are from our last move, so they're already like worn out and like they've been through freaking rainstorms, windstorms on the deck. So they're very like flimsy and this one's so structured, it feels weird. But I'm just gonna use my Sharpie and I just have to write on it because we're not gonna be there when everything gets delivered, so my parents are gonna be there since they have, they're gonna have the keys to the house anyways since we're not there for possession day, but I have to write on what rooms they go to so that way the movers know. Yeah. Okay, so it's currently at 12.18. They tried to deliver a thing. I answered the phone call to buzz them up. It went blank. Then they called Tanner and then he couldn't do it. And now they're like, sorry, we tried to deliver it so we won't be delivering it now. It's like, it's not my fault that the buzzer didn't work. So now I gotta wait for it? I don't even know what it is either. But it's 12, 18. I think I'm going to, I gotta respond to a few of my clients quick, but I think I'm gonna maybe eat and then get my stuff together and go to a coffee shop for a couple hours until Tanner's done, possibly. I'm just gonna double check with him to see how long he thinks he's gonna be, so I'm not there for like way too long, plus the one I wanna go to. Um, you can only pay for like three hours of parking max, and then you have to leave the area or like go park on a different street. So I'm hoping it's only gonna be that time frame, but let's make food. I'm gonna do a full what I eat in a day video as well soon, um, but I'm gonna make food. I actually don't even know what food I have before I have anything made, so I gotta check. But if not, ooh, um, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so let's figure this out and then we're gonna head out. Okay, I don't know what I'm eating. We have cereal. Mm. Okay, so I don't really have any meal prep left cooked because I need to cook more protein, but I forgot we bought these. Um, Tanner took the package off and now I don't remember what they're called, but some sort of like jalapeno, something smoky-ish so obviously not the most like nutritional value out of smokies or like processed meat things like this but if it's all i have it's not going to kill me for one day so we're going to eat this so i get some food in my system he just said that it's probably going to be a really long day for his work so i actually just might head out to a coffee shop work for the three hours and then come home or something like that so i'm just going to see okay yeah they had a horrible first start of the day, so probably 
probably not going to be quick for them. So either I'm going to just go for three hours, work, get some a bunch of stuff done, zone out, and then come home and maybe do some more organizing. I don't know. But let's just make some smokies. This has been probably the longest, most boring video so far of just me talking. But I'm trying to vlog more and trying to get more into this. And obviously I want to get used to it a little bit better. So that way when we move, I can actually do it. Because there's so many more exciting things that are going to happen once we're moved. Um, especially the house. The house is beautiful. So it's going to be so nice to film in. But let's make some smokies. I hate this. Now I can't track them because I don't know what they're called or have the package. And I track all my food every day. So let me see if I can figure it out. But... I'm going to make these and I'm going to see what kind of carbs and proteins, or not carbs and protein, carbs and veggies I have in the fridge to see what we can add to it. But my main goal is hitting my protein every day. So that's what I get to do and that's all. That's fine. But let's just make them and eat them because I'm so hungry now. They're so slimy. This feels disgusting. They're so slimy. Ah, they're slippery. I don't see a package for them, so I literally have no idea what they're called, but we're going to eat them anyways. Okay, I'm going to eat it with sweet potatoes and the rest of the little bits of broccoli I have cooked. Um, I just measured out my... This is so crooked. Okay, I measured out my sweet potatoes and my broccoli so I know how much to put in my fitness pal. Like I said, I'm eating a lot of food, but I'm going to go into my lunch and search up cost, Costco sausage. Okay, the only thing you can find is a jalapeno sausage from Costco. So I'm just going to do a gram check and just measure out this. I think it's fairly close to what these ones are anyways. Like they are jalapeno, I just don't remember exactly what they were called. But I'll just cook them and then I'm gonna measure them cooked, add them in, see where I'm at, and then we're gonna get ready and go to the coffee shop. So I'm just gonna go without him, knowing like if he's gonna be done work soon-ish after or not, but I need to get some work done and I need to go to the gym today too later, so yeah. Sorry, this is so boring probably, but we'll eventually go somewhere. I don't know about you guys, but I love ketchup on any sort of like sausage, hot dog. Yeah. So I'm using this like organic one. Usually, ooh, I used the no sugar added, but they didn't have it. I just used it on there. Then, so we have, ooh, that's steamy broccoli and sweet potatoes. So my obsession is pink Himalayan salt. So I add this to my broccoli and I love it. You can actually have salt also, by the way. Um, it's not horrible for you. Obviously too much is an issue, but you can have it. It's good. And then I use this Frank's Red Hot Thick Sauce Buffalo Ranch with my sweet potatoes. Um, usually I would eat like sweet potatoes by themselves just with like veggie seasoning that I've cooked them with but for some reason I think my like air fryer is like it's very old to be honest like I've had it since I first moved out but I don't think it's fully cooking things through anymore because half of my sweet potatoes get cooked and like half are like still kind of crunchy so that's why I use the sauce because like I cannot stomach the crunchiness of a sweet potato like it needs to be squishy so that's why I'm using it right now but I need to get a new air fryer but I'm gonna go eat this and then I'll uh, get ready so we can go on an adventure okay so, I got my bag full of all of my work stuff already. I'm just wearing, <laughs> oh, let's show the fit. I'm wearing Tanner's oversized, actually it fits him, but it's oversized on me. Alpha Elite shirt, like shirt, but it's like that like ribbed material. It is like butter soft. He doesn't know I'm wearing it. <laughs> And I don't know if I want to tell him, but I'm not one of those girlfriends that just takes clothes. Like, he has one hoodie that I wear, and it's not because it's, like, the boyfriend hoodie. It's just because it's ridiculously soft and lightweight. So I kind of just want it for myself, not for the fact that I can wear it because he wears it. But I'm just stealing this one because I really wanted an oversized shirt. I don't have any long sleeve shirts. But that, and then I got my Elf Elite, like, OG leggings. And I think I'm just going to throw my Birkenstocks on. I don't know if I want to wear... 
sandals or Converse? I think I'm going to go sandals. Pretty sure. I don't know. It doesn't matter. But we're going to go head out to a coffee shop for a little bit. I still think he's going to be a long time today. So I'll probably come home before he even is done. But I need to get some work done. So we're going to head out. I'm going to try to film a bit at the coffee shop. But I also want to edit the beginning of this video. So it'll kind of be like a mixture of like filming and editing. So I don't know how much I'll get there. But let's just leave the house because it's freaking hot in here and I need to go. <laughs> Okay guys, I, oh, I went to the coffee shop and then it took so long for Tanner to finish work and I literally like drove around for a bit, grabbed a sandwich, went to the mall to walk around and just kill time. Eventually I picked him up and we came home and he's like, hey, want to go to the gym and like our apartment gym because like our gym closes at like 8 p.m. I cannot wait to move just for that reason alone too. But he's like, oh, I want to go down. And I was like, I'll just go walk because, like, I'm not... I wasn't in the mood to, like, actually, like, work out. And I hate working out in apartment gyms. I don't know what it is about them, but I just hate it. That's just not the vibe. <laughs> so I went and walked for, like, ten minutes. And I was, like, stretching. And I'm like, yeah. I'm like, I'm going to go back upstairs. Like, I was not in the mood. I just, like, I'm so exhausted today. Like, I want to go to bed right now. So I'm like... I'm gonna go upstairs, I'm gonna have a shower, and then I'm gonna pick, <laughs> pick tan on because I know it'll make me feel better. So I'm gonna go do that, but that's uh, the vlog for today. I know it's like a lot more talking than usual, but if you guys like these styles, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you guys wanna see all the moving vlogs, leave a comment below um, or leave comments for anything you wanna see or say. And then don't forget to also subscribe so you don't miss any videos with myself or with both of us because we have a lot coming up, especially with the move. Um, but I'm so excited for it, so that's all I gotta say. I'm gonna go take my makeup off and go have a shower so I can exploit and then fake tan and oompa loompa so I feel like a 12 out of 10 tomorrow instead of like Casper. So have the best freaking day ever and I'll see you guys next week in the next video.